This is Ken from Coffee Crafters and what I thought I was going to do is give you guys a demonstration on our machine that we just got used on eBay um, to crack the cacao beans that we roasted. So we did a roasting video for you and so this is this is the machine that was recommended on that website the chocolatealchemy.com he's got a great video series on making chocolate but we're going to do it from a novice standpoint because we know nothing about it um, we've already cracked and winnowed some so we're going to show you how that works and what you do with this champion juicer um, it comes with some parts for straining actually making juice you take the screens out the screen out um, we're going to use this same machine in another video on making the chocolate liqueur where we actually take the nibs after um, winnowing and we're going to put it back through here and we're really excited because we just ordered a melanger and so we'll be making some chocolate all the way to the bar uh, when we're done but for this video let me show you how the how the cracking goes so what we do is we take the screen out of there and we're going to put this on now this juicer comes with a little magnetic thing here so until you put that back on there it won't operate when we did this the first time we made a big huge mess <laughs> this stuff flew everywhere so carrie helped me come up with a little bit better uh, method and i'm sure some chocolate maker out there is going to freak out when they see what i'm doing but what i did is I put a plastic bag over the um, over the nozzle. You just have to make sure that you know there's no plastic sticking in the bottom because there are those the burrs turning in there that are going to crack it. But this thing actually worked really good. Um, it was self-feeding, and so I have a couple of pounds of uh, Costa Rica cacao that I uh, roasted this morning on the XE. So I'm going to show you how this works and then when we got done then we use this we'll do it on the next video we'll use our new winnowing machine that I got tuned up and show you how that part works so I'm going to turn this on and show you how this works. I'm mostly just using this as self-feeding. I'm using this for stuff that doesn't fly all over the place because this is actually a little dirtier than I thought it was going to be. But you can see down in the bag there where all the the lid and the hull are all mixed together. paid like a hundred and thirty dollars or something for this uh, champion ju juicer if you if you go on ebay and you look up champion juicer you'll see a bunch of them but it really did work good it's really fun trying to make chocolate for the first time so i was trying to actually grind some nibs uh to make some coffee powder to mix in with the coffee and uh, uh bryce will will let you know that that absolutely does not work. Um, we started having Latour come out the front of our grinder right before it was totally plugged up. And I had to take it apart and, and work on it. And, uh, so it's not the way to grind. Grind it into powder. So, so that's it. We, um, we just did two pounds of nib. So it really ground it really fast. Um, so the machine worked great. So what I'm going to do now is we're going to do another video here shortly and I'm going to take this over. This is all cracked in there with the, the holes in it. And it took me a little bit to get our winter order uh, dialed up, but we'll go get that put together and we'll do another video.